Okay, it's time for another Tesla Autopilot accuracy test. Back on our favorite North Shore Drive. This time we're heading west in the afternoon. And as you know, if you watch these videos before, this is the hardest part right here in the beginning. Let's see how long it takes to be able to lock on an Autopilot. Recognize the lines. Oh, there's got the black ones, no gray yet. Okay, it's got gray, but it's never, I don't think I was going to make this light, but yeah, I'm going to take that off. <laughs> I don't see how it's going to make that. Alright, still not recognizing the lines to be able to engage going around the turn. I don't know if it'll ever get that light back there, really. It's gonna have to be really smart, but if it can learn, you know, it should be able to figure all this out. It should remember where we are. And not just my car, but the whole fleet. Other Teslas driving by the intersection should figure it out over time. I'm having trouble here. Having trouble, look, it knows where the lanes are, but it just, it's over. You see that? It knows where the lanes are, but it's over. I got some traffic piling up behind me. This is where it was really bright in my last time heading west in the afternoon. It was clouds, so it's not real bright this time. It's doing fine. Actually, if, I, if you remember from that other video, it was like two videos ago, it did amazingly well in the bright sunlight. So it's still doing well here. It's a little bit out of the lane. I don't know why it can't stay in the lane. It, it really struggles. It knows, but at least it's acting more confident now. There's another Tesla right there, S. I don't know if it has autopilot or not. All right, we're just about at the end of our run. That bus is at the end of the run. So this is overall pretty successful. Good run, except for that beginning part. That's about it. So keep watching. Give me your comments about what you think, how the system's doing. Whoop, whoop. Okay, made it. 